1978, he was running his own department, which was mainly focused on training mortgage-backed bonds. The team he built around him mostly consisted of Jews and were nicknamed Little Israel. They worked hard and were ruthlessly loyal to him. As Larry's success grew, so did his ego. By 1983, at the age of 31, he became the youngest member of First Boston's management committee, co-head of the Taxable Fixed Income Division, head of the Mortgage and Real Estate Products Group, and started the Financial Futures and Options Department. All of this enabled Larry to contribute an estimate made it $1 billion to First Boston's bottom line. But by 1986, all that success would come crashing down, and in the second quarter of that year, he lost $100 million. 